kind of loud. Okay, there we go. Hey guys, it's Madame Oreo. Welcome to my Tuesday stream. Um, I've got a little bit of a treat for you guys today. This is a game I've never actually shown um, on stream or on YouTube, either one. Um, and it's a game that I've had since uh, close to its release. I don't actually know um, the exact release date, so let me see. I will look it up. I actually went on a wild goose chase for this game um, the day after Christmas. Um, yes, I did. And aha, November 23rd, 2005. So it was the, I was like, what year was this? Um, it was December of 2005. It was the day after Christmas. Uh, one of my cousins actually got this game for Christmas and she told me about it. And I was like, oh my god, I didn't even know there was a DS Animal Crossing that came out because this was when I was kind of relatively new to the Animal Crossing series, hadn't been playing it for more than about a year or so, um, maybe two years tops, because I started playing it at Christmas time when my older sister got a, a GameCube. So I started playing this game, um, or this series, not too long before this. So this is before the days where I knew about E3 or like at the time the insider forums, like any of that kind of stuff. I didn't know anything about like where Nintendo news was broadcast other than like Nintendo Power and um, some online forums and stuff like that. So anyway, I was like, I have to get this game and I had a little bit of money saved. And so my mom and I literally went on a wild goose chase the next day. I mean, we had to, we went to probably about 15 different stores and day after Christmas is always a busy day anyway. So it was kind of like, okay, you know, are we ever going to find this? But we did eventually find it at Kmart. Kmart was one of those stores that like you could often find more obscure games at because people would forget about it. They wouldn't realize that that store even sold games. And now that store is closed, so it doesn't even exist anymore. Sorry, guys. Um, but anyway, that's my, my little colorful backstory behind Wild World. I played this every single day on the way to company rehearsal with a dance company I was interning with freshman year of high school. Um, I'd get up in the morning and go there and then come back and do my schoolwork. Um, and that was every single day of the week, five days a week. And I played this game on the way there because it was about an hour drive. So I invested a lot, a lot of time into this game. Um, and then it got to a point where I was kind of like, okay, I can't do anything else. I'm gonna start my town over. Well, we all know how that goes. Uh, I started it over for about a week and then fell off the face of the planet and shouldn't have ever deleted it in the first place. So I was like, all right, I'll, I'll restart it now because I'm in Animal Crossing hype mode. So, oh, whoa! <laughs> and I will quit rambling. I will get to, to you guys. Oh my God, go for Alex gifting that sub to Abby. A big Drew, Abby Drew, I almost said. A big Drew, thank you so much for the gift sub and welcome to the Ba family, a big Drew. Also, I'm gonna say hi to everybody who's here so far. So Sativa Sins 420, um, a big Drew, big Wild World, Nosegay the Anteater, uh, Stardev 94, uh, Go for Alex is obviously here somewhere, uh, Lucas Kobe, and to all of those here lurking, welcome to the stream as well. Wolf Jacobs, how's it going? Let's go ahead and open this bad boy. Um, the music in this game is the exact same soundtrack as City Folk, except with different audio inputs, so they sound a little bit different, which I kind of love. Uh, some of these songs I actually like better than the City Folk versions. Oh, and there she is, Big Blue Bear! I'm just gonna feature the bottom screen, because the top screen is just the sky in this game. It only shows the sky. Um, kind of a weird decision, I feel. I'm kind of like, what? I don't really know. Just shows the weather, you know, nothing special. Um, right now it's showing, welcome to Animal Crossing Wild World. It's just showing the little logo. So uh, we're only gonna have bottom screen for this because we don't even need to worry about it. Um, because my audio input inputs don't work anymore on my computer for the 3DS capture, I tried to update it and do different things, but I guess it stopped working like for a lot of people, like most people, they can't get it to work anymore for some reason. I don't really know why. Um, 
I will just be playing the audio through my mic. I know that's not the greatest quality, but that's kind of all that I can do right now. So if that truly bothers you, I'm sorry. Uh, oh, Wolf Jacob, Soundtrack of Wild World is literally my childhood. That's awesome. Um, Armand2017, welcome, as well as Rainbow Road 1996 haven't seen you in a while, and Ride Chip! Oh, you just got Wild World like a month ago? Aw, oh, see, exactly. This is my excitement right here. So, uh, the game is actually set to yesterday because I started this file the night of March 8th. And first day, you can't always do, like, everything you want to do, so I wanted to make sure I could, like, fast forward to today if we if we need to, um, and have a fun party. So, anyway, I'm gonna continue, and Mario Gamer Bowl is here, as well as go, go for Alex, welcome officially. And, um, in this game, you have to go up to the attic to sleep in order to save. Uh, it's been such a long time since I played City Folk. I wanna say it was the same in that game. This is pretty much uh, a replica of City Folk with, or I should say City Folk is more so a replica of this with more features. Um, I have an easier time playing this game than I do City Folk because City Folk started to introduce new things and um, kind of put Animal Crossing on the path that led to New Leaf, but I get frustrated with things that are missing that I got used to, um, and so yeah. But anyway, I went ahead and gave her my original name of Beffy because we're gonna be Bobo in the new game. Blue Bear lives right behind me too. Look at how cute this is. Uh, <laughs> um, so anyway, my town fruit is oranges. I had three neighbors last time I checked. The song playing currently is the day one song. So day one theme does not follow the hour of which it is. Um, but yeah. Um, you've had Wild World probably since- Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize this was going off. Go for with that gift sub to Wolf Jacobs. Welcome to the Ma family, Wolf Jacobs, and thank you so much to, um, to Big Go For. Also, we have a new star spirit in here. I don't know how, but I unlocked, um, I unlocked- another star spirit slot so now there's a two month slot i have one two three six nine and one year slots um for star spirit so that's all that's six of the seven the only one we're missing is kalmar um so you might notice that the star spirit next to my name is uh clevar so some of you may have clevar now instead of uh miss star and it, it really just depends on how long you've been a sub to my chan um but yeah Torterra Bite! How's it going? Nose Gay, I want to make sure I said hi to you. I saw you and I don't know that I said your name. But, hey, Gofor is giving you a hot... Or, I'm sorry, Gofor, is it? Lo Lucas Kobe is gifting you a hot sub. So, thank you, Lucas Kobe. Welcome to the Ba family. You guys are so generous with all these gift subs, I swear. Oh, oh, so did you want something from me or what, Peach? I've been making her sand here for, like, forever. Okay, everyone in Moonbeam loves to sing, Peach. Did you know you can change a town tune? So right now, they're gonna tell us a lot of tutorial-based type things because we just started the town. I didn't do anything other than start the town and go introduce myself to my neighbors. And I obviously went in my house and had Tom Nook come out and tell me that I have to work for him. But I have done zero work for him yet, so... Um... But yeah. Armand, you have Clevar! Woohoo! Um, Luke, wait a minute, Nosegay, Lucas Kobe gave you a gift sub, Torterra by, uh, uh, Torterra by, I actually don't know, <laughs> uh, probably, I, I don't, I, I don't even know, I'm, I'm tripping up now, um, I know, Blue Bear, Blue Bear's default Catchphrase is Peach. I haven't even been over to this part of my island, so I'll show up my island. Um, I posted on Twitter that I have Pudge, Blue Bear, and Nan, so I'm so excited because I got two bears. Uh, oh, ladies! Hype train incoming! It's Big Pixie in the house! Thank you so much, Pixie! I give you all the bars. Welcome back to the Ba family, and you've started the hype train! 
which is 94% reached. Oh my gosh. Um, oh, Pixie, look at you being all muscular now. <laughs> yeah, Pixie, you started the hype train, so you're going to have that, like, hype train conductor badge. You're buff. Yes, hi, kitty. Kitty's like, why you play Animal Crossing and not just play with me? Um, I had peaches at one point, too. I think that was in my, uh, in Pimphood. Uh, okay, so I haven't even been over to this side of the map. I was showing this off. My town is, like, divided into two halves, which is pretty cool. Um, I said I wanted to live by the beach, so that's why my house is pretty southern. I'm trying to explain things. Why do you have to explain? Um, but then, yeah, I'm really excited because I have two bears and one... <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I have a goat. Okay, anyway, wow. Die Fan 48, love it to the light. B Ball 1986, Rolly64, Asbeth. You have been gifted subs from Go For Alex. Go For! Thank you so much for your generosity. Holy crap, this is happening again. This is unreal. Thank you guys so much for your incredible support. Thank you so much, Go For, for all the incredible gift subs, seriously. Um, but welcome to the Ba family, my god. Okay. <laughs> oh, Kitty Laid. Like, oh, this is wonderful. Um, wow, you guys are, like, on top of each other. I don't know if it's always like this. Maybe it is. I think it might be. Because you can answer and say, like, I moved here for the shopping. We're gonna hear all these notifications, by the way. Also, go for it. I hope that your, your show went well last... Or, <laughs> I say last night, a couple nights ago now. Um, feels like last night. Okay, so we have to wear this work uniform. Really you don't, but I think it's kind of fun too because like it's the only time in the game where you're told you have to wear something. All right, so we have some blue bear furniture. Oh, and a flamingo, how sweet. We can get a net and a fishing rod today. So unfortunately we don't have any shovel today, but we can do both of the other activities in town. Um, this game has the message in a in a bottle, which is kind of like sometimes hilarious. And then we have a carpet and a wallpaper right away because unlike New Leaf and upcoming New Horizons, we start in a house, not a tent. Oh, I don't know why I'm leaving. Um, pimps always support each other. Oh my gosh, you guys are unreal. Um. Yeah, instead of big pig bear, it's a small flamingo. I'm trying to get to, yes, um, I got my stylus out. So yeah, my town's name is Moonbeam. I wanted to do something kind of like cute and fairy-like, um, because I'm not sure if I will be doing that for sure. I might be doing something similar, uh, for my New Horizons town, haven't decided yet. Look at how hot we are in our uniform. I also got the, um, classic pink try tails um you know three pigtails on my head and the cute like brown eyed face which I like because I have brown eyes so yeah I'm a day behind Mario Gamer Bowl because this is day one so I wanted to be able to uh fast forward to the next day I said that earlier but I think it was before you were here okay simply plant this crap so this is the thing that people would tell me in my Let's Plays that I always thought was really funny. Um, and it's that um, you can take these plants and just, I keep pressing the wrong thing. You can take these plants and just plant them in front of your house, <laughs> which is really funny. Here's Nan, by the way. Nan's over here checking us out. What do you need from me, kid? Got any gossip? Oh boy. So yeah, you can have um, four people living in one house. So that was really nice for like um, kids who they shared cartridges. They could each have their own character. Like I always um, am very appreciative of stuff like that because I was 100% that kid growing up who had, you know, three sisters, one of which didn't really care, but two of which would fight to play the game. And so it was good to have at least three files. Um, I love how these villagers talk as well. Oh, I just, I forgot, like, the hype train is going on stuff. I'm like, what is this at the top here? I can't believe it, you guys. You, 
that's unbelievable. <laughs> we got a hype train emote last time too. I'll show it off. We got an actual train and then we have our unicorn butt from last time. Uh, Sheep and TV, how's it going? Anyway, I'm gonna do what everybody else does. I'm going to plant, hi blue bear. I'm going to plant these trees and flowers around. I'll do half and half. I'll do, I'll do like, what am I doing? I'll do like one tree. Okay, it's probably too close to the stones. It's probably not gonna survive, but that's cool. Um, I'll do two trees actually. Two trees over here, my sapling. And then I'll plant two flowers over here, hot. <laughs> and then I'll plant the other flower. Oh my God, another hype treat Evo. That's amazing. What is this now? Hype Bigfoot. Oh. Go for gifting that sub to Sheep and TV. 58 gift subs. That's unreal. Wow. Um, thank you so much, Go for and welcome to the Ba family. Sheep and TV. Hi, Bigfoot. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Thank you so so much, you guys. That that's so cool. Um. Okay, so how, I don't think there's actually a bridge down here. Oh, no, there is. I haven't even been down this way yet. I have to get the hang of my own town because I don't, I don't know it yet. I, like I said, I just created it, so I'm unfamiliar thus far. Um, oh, that's the Abel sisters. I remember Nintendo Power having really, really cool artwork that people had made for the ground and landscape. This is how people customized. And I actually made a lot of what was in Nintendo Power, um, but it was hard to work with because when you put something on the ground, it would um, it would disappear if you press like the run button. So it was kind of tricky. Oh crap, I didn't plant the rest. Look at this. I'm so bad at this. I can't take direction, appar apparently. Um, <clears throat> look at all these star spirits in chat. Oh, the clevar looks so cute, too. Alright, so let's go ahead and plant. I gotta get used to pressing the right button. Let's go ahead and plant, not grab. Uh, plant. Oh, I should have planted roses around my house. That's okay, we can pick these up later. Alright, Nook. Oh, thank you for the follow, Sheep in TV. Welcome to the Pimp Zone. Um, okay. Alright, we did. What should I do next? Oh, how silly of me. Okay, so I have introduced myself to everybody. Um, so I won't actually have to do this part, I don't believe. Oh, you know what? I don't think I introduced myself to the mayor, so I will have to do that part. But I have introduced myself to the neighbors so far. So... Oh my gosh, Nintendo Power was my childhood as well. Um, I loved it. I remember begging my dad for a subscription to it when we got our N64 because there was a little... When you used to buy game systems, they'd have little cards in there that were like, subscribe to Nintendo Power, and it would have like all of these freebies you could get for subscribing. And so the Christmas we got our N64, I, I got that and I begged my dad. I was like, Dad, can I please get this N64? And I actually wrote a letter to Nintendo with like the card. Which they wrote me back, which was super cool as like a seven-year-old, you know. Um, and, sorry, I'm just trying to explore some of the grounds to see what's where. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, he he let me get a subscription and I, I loved it. I can't tell you guys how much I love those magazines. I wish I had them still. I only have one of my old original magazines because my mom was a mom and cleaned out stuff and threw it away. So I was like, no. Also, where am I going? I need to go meet the mayor. I think I just missed Town Hall. Well, right, Chip. Look at that sub hype. Thank you so much. Welcome back to the Ba family. As always. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm not very good at knowing where I'm going. Look at how cute Blue Bear is. I'm gonna talk to Blue Bear again. 
Some of the dialogue in this game is really funny, too. I see it on Tumblr all the time. Like, old posts. Or not old posts, but posts of this game. And it's like... Some of the old dialogue. Beppy, you're always not so nice to everyone. I bet you have tons of friends. You should totally get together with everyone you know. Wow. Four people. That's a hot commodity. <laughs> it's so nice. It sounds so sarcastic. Um... Yeah, you're right, Wolf Jacobs. The, the dialogue in Wild World is definitely more gossip-like. There's Tortimer. I was like, I'm looking for this, and I went every which way, but in the direction of Town Hall. Um, let me ask you a question. Let me see if I, I can do this instead. I should be pulling this up, too. Yeah, pull this up here, so I'll be looking up at this screen. All right, who do I respect the most? <laughs> the chief... The mayor, the mail clerk, the CEO. I'm gonna say the CEO. I, <laughs> I love that like, oh. My heart feels the pay pangs of a thousand tiny icicles. You, what's your name? Beffy, eh? A fine name. My name is Tortimer, I'm Bear of Moonbeam. On holidays and, <clears throat> and days when there are events going on, be waiting for you. There aren't really that many events in this game. Um, I guess for the size of the game, they just took them out. Um, so a lot of events are actually missing from Wild World. Which makes it a little less daunting, I guess you could say, but yes, I did. Oh, did I just mess this up? <laughs> Hold on, you guys. I gotta reset. Um, you can't see the full screen! Alright, there we go. Sorry, I had to make it bigger for me, and I ma also made it bigger for all of you. <laughs> I just didn't want you guys to be able to see it. Let's be real. I'm kidding. There we go. Let me see if that worked. Okay, good. That fixed it. I was like, what did I... Yeah, I made it bigger. And then I minimized it, which is not good. Okay, here we go. Now we're good, officially. We're officially good. Sorry about that. You just missed Tortimer whining. Um, cr I'm just crushing dreams, you guys. I'm just crushing dreams. There we go. Now it's... Oh, we get to deliver to Blue Bear. Don't stop to chew the fat along the way. See, he's already talking about gossip. Yeah, I, I blew it up on here so I could look here and not be like, mm, in this tiny screen, because it's kind of stupid. It's like, I could have it big on here. Big, yeah, bigger stop. So, sorry about that. I just want I just want to make sure you guys were <laughs> paying attention. Um, you're playing on DSi? I'm actually playing on my original 3DS, because my original 3DS was made into a capture device. I never had a DSi. I have the original DS, uh, 3DS, and a 3DS XL. Never got the 2DS or any of that either. Okay, Blueberry, you were just here. Around here somewhere. There's Nan. Uh, there's Blueberry's house. There's my house. Freaking weeds. There's Blue Bear. She was blending in for me. Alright, Blue Bear. Hey, looky here. It's Beffy. What's up? Okay. Delivery. Alright. But yeah. Ugh, you used to have a DS. It got stolen. That sucks. I mean, Cody and Blue Bear do look similar. No worries. They are both Blue Bears, but... Um, all right, you should take my, wh what? Western fence? This isn't the kind of crap I wanted, Blue Bear. Oh, sweet, you're giving me crap you were gonna throw away. You know what, Blue Bear, you're getting a little snarky over here. All right, so again, this is like a tutorial-based conversation. Old man Nook, I'm running over my tree, that's really bad. I love that my roof is pink, that makes me happy. Um, okay. No. Alright, we gotta place our western fair. What the heck? 
This is so stupid, Blue Bear. You could have given us any kind of good piece of furniture and you give us this crap. Awesome. I always wanted this dumb western fence. Lame. She could have given us anything else and it would have been more exciting. Blue Bear, you're causing a ruckus already. My hair is pink too, you're right. I love this pink hair character. Um, <clears throat> actually, after the stream today, I need to work on photographs for a lot of the Animal Crossing merchandise that's going up in my Etsy shop. I can't tell you guys how much I've been working on this crap. Like, I've been working so much on this merchandise. Um, and I worked on some other pieces yesterday. Uh, oh, sweet. Oh, yes, Nan. Alright, gotta send this letter to Nan. But I'm really excited about how everything's turning out. Um, I actually worked on some of my characters yesterday. I'll show those off. Um, <clears throat> actually, I'll just show off the three things that are kind of sitting together. I was going to make these into keychains. So I made uh, this pinky. So that's... I was like, I'll just start with my favorite characters and go from there. So like, I have this pinky that's going to be... I can probably add a keychain to her. I don't have one that's the color I want, so I'm like, well... Maybe I'll, I'll have to figure that out. But anyway, here's the pinky. And then this is the um, blue bear that I made yesterday. So I've been figuring out these patterns, which takes a really long time. Um, hence why art is more uh, expensive than commercial stuff. But this is blue bear. And then we have the classic bell bag. So, uh, which bell bags and fossils and pitfalls, those are all going to be... Um, easier to get a hold of, but yeah. That's my merch so far. Thank you for sharing the link, Mario Gamer Bowl. This is not my merch so far. This is just a very small portion of it. So, um, all right, so we gotta write a letter to Nan. Uh, and I pressed the wrong button again. Solid merch. All right, we're gonna write a letter. So yeah. Anyway, um, I love disembodied heads. I love uh, keychains like that. That's why I was like, I gotta make, I gotta make this right, you. Um, but yeah, animal houses do look super adorable. Moon Garden Emer, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Okay, so dear Nan, I. Oh shoot. I love your style. Hold on. I love your style. Uh. Oh, what do I want to say? I want to do like a poem. I love your style. But Nook big hate um update uh hold on buy some hold on no some new crap for he, he la, 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 la. where's the there we go heel punch no punch you I can't do this you in the oh I can't out of room, hold on. Punch you, here, punch your face. Yay, look at how hot that is. Dear Nan, I love your style, but Nook Big hates. Buy some new crap or he'll punch your face. From, uh, from, 
from Puff Daddy. Hot. There we go, yes. Okay. Uh, here, we'll send her my shirt, too. Alright, cool. <laughs> We're writing a rap, obviously. Uh, Phineas Freak, how's it going? I'm running up to send a big old letter. So the post office and town hall are basically the same place. Starting now. Alright, this is the window. Mail a letter. Yeah. Oh my gosh. There we go. <clears throat> from Ba? Nah. Gotta be from Puff Daddy if it's a rap. Um, no. I gotta, uh, I gotta give kudos to, to old projects, you know. What was it? Puff Dad was part of, um, Let's Play Yoshi's story, because I couldn't... I don't know why it was Puff Dad. I can't remember the the joke behind that, why it wasn't Puff Daddy. <laughs> oh my god, it was so stupid. Okay. So now I gotta go back to Nook. Really? You like Phyllis more than Pelly? I've never liked Phyllis, but that's because she's just a jerk. Um. Okay. Took a little longer than I expected to, Nook. Alright, carpet's going to Pudge. We have yet to see Pudge. Um. Alright. Nook's such a cutie. I really do love Nook. I hope, what I always dream about owning is a pitfall from Animal Crossing. Yes. I wish pitfalls were like real life things. Because that would be like hilarious. Puff Dad was actually Mario Party 5. I didn't play as Peach willingly, like that just happened. I don't understand how that was from Mario Party 5. How is that from Mario Party 5, though? It couldn't have been that episode where I accidentally played as Peach. I know that there- I swear to god there was a Yoshi named Puff Dad in Let's Play Yoshi's Story. Alright, Pudge is so cute. He's like an orange bear. Oh, freaking Peach. Um, oh sweet. Um. Oh my god, you almost had all pigs in your new leaf town, the big Caesar ruin. Well, Caesar is a ruiner, so. Daniel Haruhana, how's it going? What, kitty? What's going on? You gotta tell people? You gotta tell them about yourself? Hi. She's rubbing on me. All right. Uh, 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 uh. You love that KK song? They have different music playing in this game in their houses than I remember them having in other games, but it could just be that my memory is messy. Okay. So, watering can to Nan. Yeah, don't get the urge to water any flowers. Well, it's better that you gave us a watering can this time than a freaking axe. I love when Nook gives you the axe and he's like, now don't do anything with this axe. And it's like, um, why would you do this? Too much trust, too fast. All right, Nan, there you are. Gotta give you this hot watering can. Okay, delivery for Nan. Here's your hot watering can. Yeah, Nook never delivers anything to me in person. Whoa, dear Nan, I love your style, but Nook big hates. Buy some new crap or he'll punch your face. Yes, Puff Daddy. Everybody in town loves getting a nice letter once in a while, kid. Alright, cool. Yeah, 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 we get it, Nan. 
Nan is literally the black sheep of my neighbors. Although he is a black goat, so it kind of works. Um, oh, this was your first AC game? That's awesome. Uh, this was the first Animal Crossing game that I officially own that was my own cartridge slash disc because the original Animal Crossing disc just belonged to my sister. Don't write anything embarrassing. All right, well, then we will do just that. Right, kitty? Oh, that's so nice. Kitty's next to me giving me squinnies. Um, all right. <clears throat> okay, so. Oh, cherry tomatoes are great. But how many are too much? That's the message of the week. That's terrible. Write message, flip page, end. Cool. All right, we're gonna post. Gosh, I don't even know. Uh, what should I post, kitty? She's like, yeah, tell me I'm beautiful. Uh, Nook be like. Let's see, what does Nook be like? I need a... No, not that. I need like a symbol. Mmm. Mmm. That's not making any difference. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, Nook be like... Gimme... Yo... Money. Give me your money and drop it. I'm just gonna make all these dumb, like, like it. No, not. Why is this? Oh, Moonguard Mamer with that gift sub from Gopor. Thank you so much. I give you all the bots. It was funny because that started going off, and I was like, "No, that's not what I was saying no to." Welcome to the Ba family. Um, uh, thank you so much, Go For. Drop it like it hot, honey. How about that? Hobie? No. Honey. Oh, snap. Okay, let's give some of these symbols. Oh, okay, whatever. One symbol. Yes. Okay, solid, solid advertisement. I didn't even check for spelling errors, so if there are any, oops, I didn't mean it. David Alexander 64, what's up? Drinking some Irish breakfast tea, nice. I'm drinking my vanilla tea. So good. So, so, yeah, Hobie. It's so good. All right, we are done with work forever. Woohoo! All right, so I owed like 19,000 something. Now I owe a whopping 18,400. All right, so we gotta s sell a bunch of crap. All right, make town hall, get your deposits in, blah, blah, blah. We already know, Nook. All right, so now we're out of that first song. So we should, yeah, all right, we're fired tight. Yahoo! I'm done with work and I'm free. Oh my god, I love this song. This is the noon the, the noon o'clock song. Gonna eat food? Alright. See you in a bit, Mario Gamer Bowl. Uh Wolf Jacobs, see you later. Thanks so much for coming by the stream. Okay, so now we can officially sell stuff. Uh, in my opinion, Wild World is the most difficult game to make money in. It really is. Uh, and we're going to buy that table in there. We may end up selling this classic carpet as well. I meant to check and see what it even looked like. 
Oh, I love it. Uh, I love this soundtrack. Okay, so place. No. Oh my God! Leave it to me to do the wrong thing. <laughs> okay, seriously. Um. Oh well, it's blue, so it actually might work with that table we're gonna get. So. Where's Frago at? He's always next to my desk. He's just like not on camera because he's on the side that I'm looking at. So I'm actually redecorating my um, living room because it's also like my office area. And so I'm redecorating it right now to be more Fairy K because I have a lot of uh, toys and dolls that I've collected over the years. Oh, sweet coconut. Uh, a lot of toys and dolls that I've collected over the years. Um, and so I want to display them and I have a lot of like books in my bookcase that I've read already that I'm probably not going to read again because um, I am pretty good about that but like yeah I just have a lot of books that like I know I'm not going to read again or you know some that I need to just put away because it's like like I have like my baby book and stuff out and it's like whenever we'll get this out and look at it. Um, Okay, so I'm not going to sell the coconut because I will need to plant that, so that'll just have to go in my house. Uh, but I will sell... Stop pressing the wrong buttons! Uh, I will sell... Oh, I was like, why am... Why can I not... There we go. Alright. But I will sell the... the other stuff. I did start a new file. I... I started a brand new file on this game because I had reset it a long time ago and then never played it, so... I wanna sell. I think you can sell everything at once, which is nice. Selling this western fence BS. I wanna keep that. Um, this is just like City Folk, New Leaf, any of those. Where if you need more storage space, you can always write empty letters and put items in the letters just for the time being. And that'll be like, you know, a way of getting around that kind of crap. Okay. Oh wait, this is a bench! I was thinking this was a table. Dang it, I don't want a bench! Alright, well we'll hold off on that then. We're going to get the pieces we actually need. Yes, give me this net. I need this net. Because we've got to start our museum. We know, Nook. We've played this game before. Alright. Would I ever make a video about how to stream a Big Drew? I would if people were really, like, if, if a lot of people want me to, or if, if you're interested in that kind of thing, then sure. My stream setup probably isn't the most state-of-the-art, but like, hey, it works, so I'd be willing to do that for sure. Also, big snack attack at eight is here in his muscular form. What's up, girl? Um, okay, what did I just click on? <gasps> Fairy tale wall! Yes, but I don't have enough money. Oh, it's like the candy wall! Oh my gosh, we have to get fairy tale wall. What? Well, I'm sorry if that disturbed you, but I need that fairy tale wall hype. I do. Cabana flooring, show it to me. No. Okay. All right, Nook, you got to get out of our way. We're trying to trying to make money here to get fairy tale wall. Ooh, we got to change the town tune to the town toot. Oh, classic money in the tree. Alright, we gotta shake all these trees to get money and find stuff. And even if we find bees, it'll be worth it because their hives are hot. I don't know that there's a quick access to... Does anybody remember, is there a quick access to tools in this game? I don't think there is. I'm um, trying to test it. Don't think so. Alright, forget this crap then. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna shake the trees. I know, riveting gameplay, you guys, but we gotta do it. 
I know I love that wallpaper. Oh, sweet. What's this? Dartboard. All right. Big sell. Gotta get all the crap to sell. I'm pretty sure I shook all these trees. All right. Too bad we don't have a shovel because then we could do the rock thing. But guess what? We just can't. Hot. Whatever, I don't care. I don't mind because... Alright, I know. It just makes us look kinda ugh. Alright, so we don't wanna... <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. We don't wanna sell fruit just yet. Yeah, I would rather not have a bar room. I want something cute. A bar room is not cute to me. To each his own, but not my style. I'm probably shaking trees I already shook. Um. Yeah, can I imagine if another western fence fell out? What if? Thank you, Rainbow Road 1996. The bees. Why do these bees come at night? Wait, what happened to the... Wait, can you not collect the hives in this game? Did I just make that up? Are you serious? Or did I pick it up already? Oh my gosh, wrong button. Guys, you can't collect the hives in this game. <clears throat> How rude. I can't believe this game deceived me. All right, we gotta try and bank some some money. We're getting wrecked for no reason, then. We should be trying to catch these dang bees. All right, next bees that fall out, we're gonna try and catch. I've never shaken bees out of a tree before, you guys. Oh, I see, like, a ladybug. Hold on. I know, it's, like, blasphemy to, to catch bugs and not immediately... No, what are you doing? catch bugs and not immediately put them in the museum. No! I didn't do it! <sighs> Alright. Why do these honeybees come at night? Um, I I really love when <clears throat> Excuse me. I really love when you, like, are asked to catch a bug for neighbors and you give them, like, a mosquito. That's, like, the funniest thing. If I missed money. Um, when is my gaming chair coming? I ordered it. I'm not sure when it's supposed to be here. I need to check the tracking number. Um, this really is the hardest game. Literally. Yes, I agree. I still need to track the... Or check the tracking number because I don't know that it's actually shipped yet because I ordered it over the weekend. So it's like, I don't think that it will have shipped. Also, you hear the, the wind there. That means that a present is blowing above my head on the screen that you guys can't see. But we don't have a slingshot, so it doesn't matter anyway. Um, I'm so excited for this gaming chair, you guys. I, it's going to be so much more comfortable. It's going to make streaming and editing and video making so much easier seriously so thank you guys so much for donating to that i haven't switched the goal yet because i don't know what i want the next goal to be yet part of me wants to be like let's get an animal crossing switch but i know that i could also sell my current switch in order to do that to offset the price of it so like um but I would need to look up like how much that would be so I can appropriately set the goal. Um, and also see if more of those more of those even become available because right now they're all pre-orders are all sold out. So it's like, I don't know how likely that is anyway, but we'll see. So. Um, bum, 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 bum. All these digging spots and we have no shovel. I really wish that the shovel was just always on the first day. Like, I wish it was always part of the first day. Because when it's not, it really makes it harder. Okay, I promise that I'm not only going to shake trees here, but 
Uh, Trinity Love Fall, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. You're trading your current Switch in to get the Animal Crossing one. Yeah, exactly. It's so cute, but oh God, I'm always pressing the wrong button. Um, oh, there's another honeybee. I could try and get that. Okay. Um, I know, missing out on the, the money rock. Um, but yeah, I know that like trading, trading in, you get less than you would if you like sold on eBay, which is, uh, you know, as an eBay seller, that's just something I always do uh, over, uh, I never trade my games in or anything because you, they barely give you any money for it comparatively. Um, systems I think they have better deals on typically. Even then, it's like, with the whole, like, coronavirus thing, it's like, I wonder if they'll even accept, like, trade-ins at some places. Because I know, last time I went to Starbucks, I tried to hand them my cup to save the environment, and they're like, sorry, we can't use your own personal cup with all the crap going around. I was like, oh, okay. So, um... And it's affecting business and stuff places because they people don't want to order from places that have like any cases or whatever. So it's like it, it makes a difference. I, it's stuff you wouldn't even think of, but it's like bad. So, um, I actually got a message like on my Etsy store last night. I need to respond to that's like, where is this stuff coming from? Because I'm trying to take precaution with the coronavirus out in the open and I'm like well luckily I need to respond and be like well it's coming from Indiana which is not like a high risk state luckily oh 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 okay hold on we gotta do this um but yeah it's like I can imagine people are nervous about that and we'll be like yeah I can't oh what how, do, how am I supposed to do that yeah, kitty, how? Um, but yeah. Your friend has to work from home. Yeah, it's just like a crazy time. They don't know what this virus is gonna do. Because um, I think that's what they're worried about. It's also like mutation of the, the virus. But yeah, it just, it depends on where it's coming from and... Luckily, I'm not in an area that's, like, highly infected. Thank God. I don't want anybody to be from an area that's highly... I don't want any area to be highly infected, you know? Like, that just is awful. So. But. Uh, and a Fright and Togepi fan, how's it going? I mean, you missed the beginning of the... You missed, like, the first, I guess, hour of the stream? But it's no big deal. We've just been uh, playing first day stuff of Animal Crossing Wild World. These games eat time, I swear. So much time goes by when you're playing this game and you don't even realize it. Um, yeah, hi kitty. Kitty is going crazy. Oh, I know, the 1 p.m. music, Kevy Rise, it is so nostalgic. I love all this like mid afternoon music. Um, because it's just, it brings back so many memories. For me, more so for this game than even City Folk. Because City Folk, I started and played the for the first time for the Let's Play, so that was like its own little adventure, which I feel like is why I probably remember the least about it, um, and the least about that particular Let's Play of all the Animal Crossing projects I've done. That's the one I, I remember at least. Hey, you have a, you have a net, Nan. Why don't you get that butterfly? 1 p.m. music is my jam. Um, uh, you're lucky and you're friends with a guy at EV Games, so they... Oh, that's awesome. See, that's legitimate. That's awesome. Oh, uh, gotta get ready for big work. All right, go for it. Thank you so much for all the gift subs and for the hype train. Look at you being that hype train conductor. You're so generous and kind. I'm I'm very grateful. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a great day at, at big work. Working it. Anyway. 
Okay, have I shaken like every tree? I'm gonna stop shaking trees here in a minute because I know this is probably extremely boring. <laughs> uh, I just wanna get an, uh, this is why. I wanna get enough to get that wallpaper. I'm really not worried about anything else. Uh, Mr. Skin and Bones, welcome to the pimp zone. Uh, I, I want to say, like, um, I'm coming out with a video on my channel that's about Animal Crossing music, spoiler for all of you guys here, um, because I was trying to pick my favorite songs from all Animal Crossing games thus far, like the main games, I didn't look at anything for, um, like, uh, Happy Home Design or any of that, but, like, from these games, and... I think, honestly, the my favorite music and the most iconic music comes from this game, like this and City Folk. Um, so, but yeah, tree shaking and catching all about that daily wild world grind. It's so true. Uh, Eld18, what's up? Um. Right now, my friends list is only open to people I know in person, just because I want to be fair and I don't want to, you know, accept some people and not others. So, um, I'm sure that when it comes out, I'll have some sort of program like I did with New Leaf that will make it where um, viewers can play with me at a time, but as of right now, I'm not adding anybody that I do not no in person, so sorry about that. Um, okay, so I think we're good for that, uh, whatever it's called. I know, I got blue bear, isn't that crazy? Uh, I, I wish that I could have just kept MW TV, but it had like all kinds of copyright crap because you know, Nintendo was not the most generous about that kind of thing. Uh, what I am going to do as well, so I don't have to do this later, is I am going to put this random image as my wallpaper. Because that way I can sell the current wallpaper. Yeah, but I'll make you a best friend so you... <sighs> So you can mess up my town, Snack. Do I trust Snack with this responsibility? <laughs> uh, I think it's so funny they have that feature, like, hey besties, you're allowed to mess things up, but not other people. Okay, so now we can get our wallpaper, sell all this crap, and then we'll talk to some neighbors and stuff. Also, we need to go to the Able Sisters, because we haven't even been there yet. Oh, I needed to put this coconut in my house. Okay, so that's stuff I need to hang on to. Dartboard, cardboard box, common wall. You're so freaking cheap, Nook. Dang it. Alright, so we need... We need this wall. We need fairy tale wall. Uh, how much is this dang? Wait, what? Oh, thank you. Uh, I need to look at how much this flamingo is, too, because it's pink. Um, kind of random, but what's people's opinion on Switch Lite? I'm thinking of saving up for one and getting Animal Crossing New Horizons. I absolutely love my Switch Lite. I play it way more than my actual Switch because it's a lot more comfortable and I'm somebody who plays handheld most of the time, like 99% of the time I play handheld. Um, and so I absolutely love it. It's a lot better for travel. It's a lot easier to travel with and to take with you on the go. It's not as big and bulky and it just feels better, like in your hands. Um, so. It, honestly, if it weren't for streaming purposes, I probably wouldn't even worry about the regular Switch. But, uh, smart guy 93 thank you for the follow. Welcome to the pimp zone. But yeah, honestly, if it weren't for that, I probably wouldn't even worry about the, like, regular Switch so much. 
Um, so I absolutely love mine, but I'm a very, I'm very um, partial to handheld gaming. So that's me. If you're not like the most partial person in the world to handheld gaming, I don't know. Um, some people love that big screen experience. My TV is, it's fine for me, but like some people, they love like a giant TV with this giant and I don't, I don't have that set up and I don't really care that much. So like, it just depends on what you like, but yeah. Anyway, best friends can message each other, whatever. Worth for chop trees. Oh my God. Slayer stars X. How's it going? 10 more days. I know. I'm so excited. Last 10 days, guys. And it's Mario day today and I'm not playing a Mario game. <laughs> Whoops. How's Madam Mom? Madam Mom is doing well. This flamingo is more money than what we have? I'm not paying for this flamingo. Um, any tips for this game to beat it? This game is the hardest. It really is. Not that you can, like, beat it necessarily, but, like, God, just to pay off your house, it's crap. I don't have any good methods. I feel like this is one of this, those games where if you have friends, it's significantly easier because you can get all their fruit and stuff and plant orchards that you just sell every day or every three days or whatever, but uh, this game's tough. This game is actually really tough. <laughs> so I always sell shells, lots of bug catching, fishing, uh, you know, running errands and stuff when I can, shooting stuff out of the sky just to sell it. Like, I don't know. I don't have a lot of good methods for this game, unfortunately. Um... Yeah, paste on wall. Now this carpet looks terrible with this. I should have kept that other carpet. Um, okay, I'm gonna place this in the room because we don't have what we need yet. <laughs> Our room is very clashy, you guys. But yeah, you don't need friends, a friend to come to your town to upgrade Nookingtons. That's true. Um, but yeah. I know, not playing a Mario game on Mario Day. How could I? How could I do? Okay, we gotta go to the museum and get this big... No! A big pitfall! This big, long spiel from... Uh, you know. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm sorry, I look tragic, Blue Bear. All right, uh, let's chit chat. Did you say that you're super good at catch? Oh my God, I'm supposed to give this honeybee to the museum. <sighs> what, as the leader of the blue? Fine. That's fine. I'll give you my freaking honeybee that I was on my way to give to the museum. <laughs> so not fair, you guys. <laughs> it's not fair. Take this dang honeybee. Better give me something good. It better not be a western fence or I'm gonna be pissed off. Yes, I did. I had it on my way to the museums. This is so uncool, unfun, and uncute. Oh my god, I don't need a wall! Blue Bear, why do you hate me? <laughs> this is so stupid! I don't know how I feel about this. Yeah, girl gotta get stationary. That's the worst. Okay, give me this freaking net. We gotta go catch bugs. How about we just, we're, we're just gonna catch a multitude of bugs before we go back to the um, museum. I can't believe this. What the heck is that? Oh, those are paint. Oh no, I ran over it. I didn't see it. Dang it. I'm not good at bug catching. I preferred bug catching over anything else in New Leaf, but in some of these other games, I'm terrible. <gasps> Big butterfly. Give me that butt. I need it. Oh my god, it's gonna get... Okay, good. So I basically need two of each because of this dang museum. Am I even worried about that though? Like, do I care right now? These are like common bugs. Like, I need money right now. Maybe I'll just worry about that later and I'll just sell all these bugs for now. Um. 
God, stationery is the best gift, said no one ever. In real life, like cute, like Japanese stationery, I will take that as a gift all day long, but I'm actually about to run out of my Japanese stationery that I bought. Um, there was this really cute stand at OhioCon every year that had tons of stationery and it was all super cheap, like super cute. Is that a bug on there? No, it's not. Um, and I'm finally just about to run out because when I ship orders in different places um, through different mediums, I use stationery like that to say thank you and to write like little, no, to write little thank you notes and so I'm about to run out, but I have a ton of stickers and I just bought a new stationery box that I saw that I couldn't resist because it had a hamster on it. <laughs> it's like an LOL surprise thing, but it had all these cute animals on it. It said, adopt me, and it came with like hamster stickers. I was like, okay, I have to get this. I don't care if I'm almost 30 years old, I need this for my stationery. And it locks, it's like old school diary type days. I'll show it to you guys because it's over on my counter, but. All right, I've caught like one bug. This is tragic. Where are these freaking honeybees? I've only caught like one and a half bugs, you guys. No more shells down. Oh, yes. Oh, no, wrong button. Okay. <gasps> yes. Oh, there's a freaking fish down here. We gotta go fishing too. Yeah, thankfully they switched this where it's like, hey, you no longer have to like have the worst mechanics possible. Um, you're planning on playing New Horizons at midnight because why not? Oh, I'm waiting. Well, I have to wait for mine to come in the mail anyway, which is supposed to be day of, so. Wild World has so much dirt. <laughs> Nin Imin B. Yes, it do. Welcome to the stream. Alright, dang fish. Where'd that fish go? Seriously, he was right here. Are you serious? This fish disappeared from me? Guys, this game hates me. This is like the hardest game to earn money in. I can't deal with this right now. Oh, there it is. There's big fish. Okay, good. I got a dab. Alright, cool. <laughs> oh, Blue Bear, how are you always on these bridges when I'm trying to cross? Okay, I got a dab, you guys. Hot dab! Oh, here's another fish. Come to mama! Oof. Wow, no dab? Give me a second snack, okay? I'm trying to catch this freaking other dab here. Remember when dabbing was like a big thing? Now it's just like a small thing. Come on. Come to the other side. I needed a look. My bow always claims I dab when I sneeze, and I'm like, I do not, but then again, I always sneeze like this, so then I guess I kind of do, but yeah. Because, you know, I don't want to sneeze all over my hand or something. Oh my gosh, this fish. You're not over dabbing. <laughs> You wouldn't be, Snag. Well, that kind of jaw should be barred. <laughs> That's dumb. Okay, come on, bugs. Oh, I see a bug. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Give me this net. Oh my god, no! What? Okay, hold on. A bug's gonna get away, and it's all my fault. Okay. I need this cabbage moth. Oh! Okay. I caught a common butterfly! Okay. Yeah, it's pretty dusty now, but you still think it's funny. It's funnier now than it was before, I think. Ah! 
I scared it because I didn't go the right way. Crap, I'm so bad at this. Blue Bear, can you give us some other information other than like catch bugs? Yeah, I got any goss? I don't think I'm ever gonna be a star in this town. <laughs> what? No, you better not! No, you're not allowed to move. No! You don't- you're not gonna know of any ta other towns, that's too bad. Um... I need these freaking ladybugs. Give me ladies! Oh, Shalia! Whoa, check out this old game! Thank you for the sub, welcome back to the Ba family! Solid hype, yo. You have Clevar now! I know, we got another star slot! I was so excited! So now we have 1, 2, 3, 6, 9, Dance So Fine, 12 month sub badges. So now the top is Clevar instead of Miss Star. And he looks so cute. I love him. Um, what? Hillary Clinton dabbing is your peak aesthetic? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's a butterfly. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, one, two, three, six, nine, huh? True. Okay, I have four more slots. I gotta fill up these four more slots. Wait, was that four? Did I count right? I don't know. I checked the dumpster earlier, didn't I? Bum ba ba ba, la la, tee dee tee da. Oh, there's crap in there. Hold on, we need it. Um, coconut palm. Who's throwing out their freaking coconut palm? Well, I'm selling it. That's what I'm saying. I love the chunky style of this game, though. I love the chunk. Um, also, I'm gonna go home. And I'm gonna get that carpet, yo. Give me that carp. Um... Because this carpet does not match my fairy tale. So, might as well sell it now. And we're gonna put down this. What? Yeah. Hot. Okay, we're just gonna paste that for the moment. Um. Okay. Cool. So now we have what? Like. Two slots. No! I scared the beetle! I'm so bad at bug catching because I want to run everywhere. <laughs> I haven't seen Pudge or Nan. Where the heck did those fools go? Butterfly. Oh, ladies! Okay. Um, so I need... I need one more something, and then I'll be ready to sell. I hear it. I hear it. Where is it? What? Oh, oh no! Yeah! Okay! So, now... We're ready to sell. We are ready for the, the hot. We're ready for the hard sell. All right. Okay, I wanna sell all this crap, so. Except my fishing rod, obviously. Watch, he'll be like, I'll give you three bells for this. 
Oh, holy bonjoli, yes. Oh, raking in the dough! Okay, good. I know, I haven't given anything to the museum yet because I'm... I gotta, I gotta game too hard. <clears throat> okay. So, now... I'm going to talk to all the animals one more time, then we're going to set it to today. Setting today for fun. And get- Oh, big bugs right in the midst of my vision, yo. Give me this bug. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, Moon be just lacking the culture. Listen, listen, Pixie, we're trying to establish our foundation here. Then we'll worry about culture, okay? <laughs> Alright, you home? Yeah. Um. Yeah, hey, <laughs> head to my furniture store. You want to buy these, you know, five butterflies, a trout, small paper, and three oranges? Sure. You know, your room is kind of strange, Pudge. You got stung, that looks like it hurts. Well, that's your opinion, yo. I'm here to talk. Wait, would I choose to eat salty or sweet food for the rest of your life? Ah, uh, I could live off dessert, so. I agree, it's all about that one little world pudgy. Cupcakes! Alright, one more time. Tell me a story, you love me! You love me not. You love me. You love me not. I love you. Oh, I love green peppers not, Pudgy. Well, what the F is your problem, dude? Um, oh, that's right. You wanted to chat about something. Give me news. Yeah, well, guess what? Not- Oh, shoot! I didn't mean to do that! I'm sorry! I meant to say you can come over! I've depressed him now- <laughs> <laughs> Guys, uh, why am I such a ruiner? I'm ruining my own game. Ruining my experience. He's like, I want to come over and see your place. No. What the heck? I did not mean to do that. Hey, you. What you want? You steal my bugs? What color do you think suits me best? Uh, probably blue, cutie. Burnt umber? What? Oh my god, that's terrible. That's definitely me. Wow, it's such a mystery. Oh, sweet. Give me something good. Stone wall? What? I don't want this crap. You're using me as your dumpster. I'm not doing this. Let's say I'm talking to you again, because this is too much. Alright, next time somebody asks me if they can come over, I'm saying yes. Ew, uh, why do you talk like that? Yeah, I'm out of dream crusher. She's a life ruiner. She ruins people's lives. Oh my god, what do you I don't wanna catch a pill bug for you. Oh my god, I don't have time for pill bugs. Okay, well, all she wants is freaking bugs. So we're gonna go find Nan and see if Nan, you probably just want bugs too! Dang it, Nan. Have we met before? Is that you? Yeah, get over my bee stings, yo. You need to, like, take a downer. <laughs> yeah, give your people garbage, but frame it as though you're giving them a gift. Solid life advice. Aren't you getting- I don't even have any furniture yet! I have, like, a candle and a boombox, like- I don't want to. I need furniture before I worry about freaking expanding my horizons, yo. Before I worry about new horizons. Oh my gosh, no! Nan, why are you so boring? Okay, give me something good. I need, like, good advice. Oh my god. Oh, sweet! I do have a common butterfly. Okay, epic mind, how's it going? Okay, I gotta give you my common butterfly. 
Uh, I caught a bug! Okay, where's my big C? Okay, give me something good. Uh, exchange common butterfly, I'll give you... No! Double stone wall? No! <laughs> this game hates me! Hates me! Are you serious? Double stone wall. I'm done with you guys. I'm done with helping you guys catch your freaking bugs because all you ever want to give me is freaking stone wall. Stone wall. Yeah, rigged and wrecked. 100%. <sighs> yeah, if you're gonna have a bug catching contest, I feel like you can do better than a common butterfly. Mr. Wario, how's it going? Freaking common butterfly. Uh, yeah, I guess they're trying to bring back that princess trapped in a tower. You're right. <laughs> I really did love that that whole room design. That was so much fun to make. Oh, hey, it's a common butterfly again. Here to wreck my world with a stone wall. One person's like, oh, it's trash. And the other one's like, oh, wow. Look at this great thing. All right, well, I think that we're gonna sell this last bit of stuff, which there's only like, if I could press the right button, there's only like four things to sell. Yeah, it's my punishment for being rude to Pudge. I didn't mean to be rude to Pudge. I really didn't. Um. Okay. Oh yeah, we didn't go to the Able Sisters yet either, so we'll do that on the way, way back home. Yeah, life hack number two. Give your friend stone wall. Freaking double stone wall. I can't. Alright, thanks for my 600 and some bells. I know, poor Pudgy. I love Pudge! I would never want to, like, deny his dream of coming over to my house. Alright, Able Sisters. Let's go, ladies. Alright. Oh, they have the bear shirt here! Yes! Look at this candy umbrella! I gotta buy this bear shirt. Because I love the bears. Um, so cute! Okay, I will buy it. Um, I probably do need to get some stationery so that I can just put my tools in the letters. Um, and I'm gonna buy this cute little candy umbrella, too. Alright, yes. Gotta talk to Sable. Disable the label. Alright. Yeah, Pudge finally works up the nerve to ask to visit, and you're like, nah. <laughs> His lifelong dream was to go over to someone else's house. <laughs> and you crushed. How could I do it? I'm sorry, guys. I'm really, really sorry. Uh, I gotta buy the stationery. Oh, ribbon paper. Uh, Alright, so now I'm gonna do my hack. Which is... This. Uh... Pudge. Uh... And then I can just send all these letters one day. Uh, I'm sorry. Come, oh no. Over, oh my god, I can't spell. Over, now. Uh, from Puff Dad, Daddy. Yeah. Okay. Write letter. Blue bear. What? Okay. 
so I really am going to send that one to Fudge eventually, but we're gonna use it for the moment. I'm sending everybody else hearts. Okay, so I need these three for slots. We're gonna send Oh, we should send a shirt to Pudge. Um, I want to keep my work uniform. <laughs> oh my god, Pudge Daddy. I should- I'm gonna change it, Nosegay. That's fantastic. Um, I'm gonna pick out a shirt for Pudge. I'm gonna get that weird looking one in this one, because it seems to match his coloring more than the stripes. The yodel shirt. Okay, give me this yodel shirt so I can send it to Pudge and not feel as bad about my poor life or dream, uh, dream crushing. Dear Pudge, uh, no. Dear Pudge Daddy. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna wear the bear shirt. And send him the yodel shirt. Yeah. Now, now we hot. Okay. Um. All right. So, yeah. This is my plan. I'm gonna send this crap. Uh, and then I'm going to put my work uniform in my house and save the game and go to the next day, which is- which will be today, so. Mail letter. No, no, I don't- I know that's it. Alright, cool. Pudge gets a letter. Everyone's last name is Daddy now. That's the law in this town. No, I don't have other things I want to mail. Okay. Alright. So we're ready to send that letter to Pudge. Nobody else has done anything in here. I don't know why I'm checking like they would have already. I remember Yodel, DK's long lost bro. That's right, there is a monkey named Yodel that was like on the island. It was on our island for some reason. I don't know why I always get these freaking apes, but I do. Yeah, Mayor Tortimer Daddy. <laughs> um, so tomorrow we'll change the town tune and stuff. How'd Yodel end up on a deserted island, I wonder? I also wonder. Um, gosh, that seems like that should be the button. Okay, place in room. Yeah. Scooch. Uh, I'm going to move it over this side. We need a shovel for my coconut. <clears throat> Fell off a mountain, maybe? Truth. Okay. Save and end. We're just gonna be starting the next day, so no worries. We're not ending here. I'm gonna reheat my key, though. It's probably gonna take a second to save. This is like the first time I've saved it since... I created my town and I saved it, so that took a minute, but this is like the first time I've saved it since like really uh, doing anything in my town. What if DK moved into your New Horizons town? You know what? Then I would pawn him off on Odie, because he'd be so excited. Um, Jopo1226, welcome. No worries, guys. We're still playing. I'm just setting the date to be today now, since we had the backlog one day. Because I just skipped yesterday because I knew I'd be streaming it today. So I was like, well, I want to do everything with you guys. So, what a bold statement. No, that's not what I meant. Um, what a bold statement to be like, I want to do everything with you guys. All right. It's now Tuesday the 10th. And we're not going to go forward in time. We're just going to go to the current day. Also, I don't think that we will have any problem in doing so. 
Because we'll have plenty of do, plenty of do, plenty to do on the current day, so. If it's Caesar, I will honestly be amused. I will. Nintendo. Did you guys see my disembodied heads earlier that I'm gonna make into like little keychains? Blue Bear and Pinky. I'm making these for my shop and I'm making all different characters. I'm just starting with my favorites and then going from there. Okay, I really want to make like Raggedy Ann style dolls too uh, that are like the title characters like Buffy here. Anyway. <clears throat> All right. Preparing Moonbeam. I did, Shliam. I ordered the chair over the weekend after that goal was met. I'm so excited. I'm so happy I got it on sale for Women's Day. So that made the goal easier to reach. Look at my... Oh, my trees! They're actually working! They're not failing. Okay, I have mail, but I gotta take, talk to Blue Bear first. Jumpin' jelly beans, Beppy. You're like a big stick of happy TNT. I'm screenshotting that, because that's an amazing quote. <laughs> okay. Oh, right, right. You wanted something? Speak to me. Oh my god. All you ever d want is for me to catch bugs. I don't want to catch this pill bug, but fine. Alright, on the off chance that I get a shovel, that'll be easier, though. Um, a big stick. What a powerful dialogue. Oh, is it from Pudge? It is! Okay, we gotta read Pudge. Uh, hi there, Beppy. It's finally here. I was waiting for it. You know, I picked this up, but it's not for me. You want it? Keep it real, Pudge. <laughs> oh god, I can only imagine what it could be. Okay, what is this crap? Present. Um. Aw, oh, grape striped tea is actually cute. That makes me happy. Okay, good. It wasn't freaking stone wall. Um. Yeah, shout out to Blue Bear's bug list. <laughs> Why is Blue Bear so into bugs? So annoying. Oh, you're exploring, Pudge. Okay. I'm pulling for stone wall. I gotta redesign the flag. Um. Oh my god, it would have been funny if, if she would have sent me a freaking stone wall. Stone wall, you guys. Here's Nan, probably wanting me to catch bugs. Okay. I need gossip. No! I don't care about these bugs! <laughs> oh my god, why? Why are you guys so into bugs? Yeah, I'll make the- the town flag should be a stone wall. <laughs> That's amazing, Pixie. Oh. No! I don't want to pill bug hunt with all you people. My god, so many pill bugs. <laughs> All about freaking pill bugs and stone walls. What am I gonna do? I hope Pudge has a life because I can't. I cannot. Um, oh no, my tree is dying that I planted. I planted it too close to the wall. Um, okay. Fishing rod and watering can. This isn't the crap we need. We need a shovel. Oh, okay, Half Year Academy is gonna rate my boring, poopy room because. Hey, count me in. Woo! Okay. I put, yeah, I planted my trees too close to the stone wall. All right, well, this is BS. What is this? Corner kitchen? Kitchen corner. 1800? My freaking the flamingo was almost that much. 
Yeah, you guys want a flamingo or you want this kitchen corner? I was hoping there'd be like a table or something. Charcoal tile. Freaking boring. Ew, what? No, what? It would have matched stone wall though. Let's be real here. Ooh, arched window! Arched window's pretty too, because it's all like church-like. Look at that big spider web up in the corner. That's pretty funny. No. I want any of this crap, Nook. None of this goes with my house. Um. Let's see. Bathtub paper. Alright, I'll take bathtub paper. Well, that was a bust. Flamingo better than kitchen corner. Uh, all right, let's go. Oh, Gracie's here. Holy. We gotta go talk to Gracie Grace here in a minute. But we're gonna go check out our style first. All right. Give me a word. Oh, never mind. What the heck? They have the Yodel shirt again? They have a chef's shirt? You have a knight helmet and Harry Potter glasses. Um, I have a grape shirt. Who... What's this? Oh, what? Not that. Okay, I want to give somebody... Oh, it's a nurse's uniform. Well, it looks very much like a chef uniform, but okay. Let's see. Um... Oh, we got a new villager! Oh my gosh! It's one I like, too! Okay, well, we gotta go check out this new villager, see if they're bug-obsessed. Where are they? Oh, they're, like, right here. Bug-obsessed. Okay, give me your stuff. Oh, that freaking classic carpet and arched window! Yes, Fridja! Oh, she's a cutie! My name is Fridja and I like to walk around. Wow, what a hot description. I'm... I also like to walk around. <laughs> Wait, why is her catchphrase brum? Like, what is that? Brum. Mmm. My place is a terrible mess. Oh no! Well, Fridja, you are a cutie. I like Fridja. I mean, better walking around than bugs. <laughs> Wait, you got Fridja? She's my absolute fave. Aw, that's awesome. Daniel Haruhana, we got your fave. Big Fridja. Check out this car that's like the same size as Gracie Grace. Uh. Wait, why are you calling the fashion police on my hot style? Uh, you know it. Alright. I'll start with my measurements, my shoulders, my chest. Uh, what would you do if you found a hole in your jeans? Uh, rip, rip, rip! Oh my god. Um... Yeah, let's rip it. Alright, number two. Um, no need. Alright, question three. Um, it's so bold. Alright, question four. What is the true essence of fashion? Um, clothes, honey. All about looks! I don't even know what I'm saying here. Here's a present. Probably an ugly shirt or something. Oh boy! Get ready for this letter that says you suck, ladies! Um, that shirt sure has that country aroma! Oh boy! Okay, what could this say? It probably has a freaking bad rep in it. Dear boring Beffy, blah boring honey, you're gonna have to work it harder than that to earn my respect. 
Well, you know what, Gracie Grace? Maybe we didn't want your respect. But I will take whatever this prez is so I can freaking sell it. It better not be a stone wall. A subdued print. What does this even look like? I'll send it to one of my neighbors. Oh, check out this really amazing subdued print. More like sub dumb. All right, I'm wearing my bear shirt. Um, I'm going to send two of these letters. Wait, what? This present out of here. Oh wait, I don't want to send Pudges because I already sent him a letter. So, um, present and present. And then we will give them these shirts. And then I know that these are tool areas. Um, write a letter to Frigia. I'm just doing this to have extra, whoops, extra space. Ha. Okay. Um, I will send Frigia a letter too, though. What do I want? I guess I'll get my net out because I need to freaking catch bugs because all these people are obsessed with them. She did say it was country. Truth. Um, okay, so I need to buy one shirt. I need to buy one shirt. Whoops, what am I doing? No, go in the house, or in the door. <laughs> yeah, boring in my subdued print. Boring, Buffy. Those are the kinds of questions that Pixie would ask. Let's be real. Okay, two people are getting this Yodel shirt. Um, I always click that wrong button. Okay, so we're gonna send off these shirts. We're gonna send off these shirts. And then we gotta freaking catch bugs, I guess. Collect seashells, get some, some money going on. Yeah. We should change, we should change the town tune while we're here too. So we need to send these. Big excite. I have actually never gotten Pinky in Wild World. No, I haven't. For a while, I didn't think that she was in Wild World because I hadn't seen her at all and nobody I knew had her in their town. But then, sure enough, people had posted photos um, online of her in their towns. So I'm like, okay, well... You know, she must exist somewhere. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, bugs on a stone wall. Oh, honey, yes! What's this? Blue bench, which was in the shop yesterday. Ooh, classic bed, yes! And a regal lamp, holy crap. We rolling in dough now. Somebody just bought that. Nook's like, I didn't sell it. I'm gonna throw it out. Never mind. I said jump! Welcome to the stream! How's it going? Uh, okay, town tune. I'm gonna... Oh, I don't even know. Let's see. We should make it your big, your big, your big, and your fat, fat, fat. What's the first note of that song? Oh, yo, yo, big, yo, big, yo, big. <laughs> Hold on. No, yo, big, yo, big, yo, big, and yo. Uh. 
Is that right? Yeah, that's right, but it's... I'm gonna do this. E... E... Um... C... D... Um... Oh, wait a minute. Duh. Hold on. Ba 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 da da da. There we go. You're big and you're fat, fat, fat. <laughs> so stupid. Okay, it works. You're big and fat is our hot town tune. Um, what are donations? Is my question. Uh, no. What? Grilled dirt? Uh, what is this lore? Uh, okay. What in the world? I'm giving you 20, 20 bells. Hot. <laughs> this song deserves some kind of an award. Okay, well, our town tune is big and fat, so that's excited. Excited? Exciting. Now we gotta go talk to somebody. And it'll play. <laughs> yeah, the boondocks. I love that big and fat is the town tune! Yay! Let's chit chat. Uh, whoa, so much gossip. Alright. Sweet. Even better on a villager. I gotta go find- we still haven't even found Pudge for the day. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Oh my god, help the boondoxians get grilled cheese and sandwiches. Or grilled cheese sandwiches. Um. Alright, we gotta go. Oh shoot, I'm destroying flowers now. Gotta go find Pudjo. Yeah, we gotta get Pudge to sing Big and Fat since we wrecked his dreams yesterday. Okay, got that honey bee hype. It said he was out earlier. He probably still is, but yeah. Where is Pudge? I need Pudge. We're gonna change the flag too, but I have to design it first. Excuse me. Who was that? Oh, that was a flower. Never mind. Oh yeah, we got this new furniture too. We should see what looks good. Pudge, where are you? Okay. No. Thank you. I'm always pressing not what I want to press. Okay, classic bed. Yes. This is the same bed that was in our princess uh, trapped in a tower room. Regal lamp. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, it matches. Okay, so we can get rid of our candlestick, honestly. And we can press the wrong button again. Place our regal lamp. All right, we're gonna sell the blue bench and we're going to drop the coconut right here in the corner. Cool. 
Yay, our house is shaping up with furniture found in the dumpster. The floor does look like, I mean, the plain white floor is like marshmallow. It is cute. Um, but yeah. Grilled cheese does sound good right now. I know, I'm gonna have to eat lunch after this. Maybe I'll make some big grilled cheese. Although last time I made it, it was turned out black because I did something else while I was cooking and I forgot that it was on the stove and I'm like, what's that burning smell? I'm like, oh, what, that freaking grilled cheese burnt. So that was exciting. Ferris Pierce does have the regal furniture in his house, which I love so much. Um, okay, but like what? Floor, floor, floor slots? Wait, did I get? Oh no, that was a footprint. Still no sign of Pudge. Where'd that pudgy boy be? Uh, huh. Yeah, I gotta re redeem myself on that grilled cheese. I do. Okay. Yeah, dumpster house designing. It's kind of the story of my life in Animal Crossing. Okay, I want to sell this crap. So, yes, selling my candle. Blue bench. No, no sign of pill bugs anywhere. I guess I gotta start hitting some of the rocks if I want any of that. Yeah. Cool. I know, he's just out since I destroyed his dream the other day. I guess we'll catch one thing for the museum so that we can talk to Blathers. I don't remember if the animals are walking around in the museum in this game. Oh no, there he is! Pudge! Oh shoot. Pudge, you're not wearing your yodel shirt that we sent you. <laughs> I love the big and fat song with Pudge. <clears throat> okay, I'm bored. Um, oh sweet. Ooh, mango cream. Alright, well come over to our house, yo. Uh, I want to talk. What would you say the distance between our hearts? Three feet, one inch, yes. You always say just what's on your mind, Beffy. Ah, What? You get along better with indecisive people. Okay. Come on, Pudge. Yeah, probably because they're always out catching freaking pill bugs. Pudge. Pudge just keeps it real. Alright, come on. I want you to come over. Bridget has a friend who lives in a mansion! Cool. <laughs> what? Are you getting annoyed with me talking to you, Pudge? I want you to- Oh no. Tell me! Hmm. Pudge. What the heck? We upset you again with this story? You told it, not us. I'm done. Get out of here, Pudge. You're wrecking our lives here. Okay, no pill bug coming out of that. I need like one bug. Blue bear stuck in a tree. Hi, you put. If only. Blue Bear's too busy catching freaking bugs nonstop. What's up, Slim? Big Slim. Big Slimbo in the house. Alright, we can go give this tiger butterfly to the museum. And. What else? Bum, bum, bum. 
Yeah, Slimbo bounce back, queen. Uh, where? In my old town, I knew where like every rock was. No, I'm trying to hit this rock. Oh, of course. Yeah, I have a clean cup on me at all times. What? You're giving me this sweet prize? A green rug? Woo! Alright. Thanks for giving me a green rug for my hot lie that I just told. Alright. <clears throat> okay, time to go talk to Blathers for the first time. A big Blathers. That'd be straight up trolling, Pudge. I'm not meaning to, I swear. Alright. Uh. Donation. Apparently, he doesn't tell you anything. He's just like, oh, yeah, you already know all this crap. Okay. So, big tiger butterfly is literally the only thing we have. No. And we don't have a shovel, so we can't find any... Um, we can't find any fossils or anything. Woohoo! The fish tanks are empty! Yeah. <laughs> Slim, it's the hot new beam! Oh my. Wow. Yeah, you're taking notes. You fully intend to bring a cup everywhere now. I think that goes for the rest of us, too. <laughs> oh, so we've got our solid, singular tiger butterfly somewhere in here. But where it be? Where is said butterfly? Apparently not in this room. Uh, oh my god, yes! Animal Crossing's new- the Animal Crossing New Horizons Museum? Unreal. Those graphics and everything, I'm so excited for it. Well, did I miss it? Where the heck is this thing? I don't see it anywhere. Oh, there it is. It's in the corner. How cute. All by its lonesome self. I love when the bug portion of the museum fills up. It's so colorful and like, has such character. Yeah, Blathers big ate it. I don't know why I'm running around here. Looks like Pokeballs on the floor kind of at first. Oh, I know. I know exactly what you're saying. It's not that the others are bad, but honey. <laughs> Check out the art museum. The hardest uh, part of the museum to fill up, in my opinion. Oh my gosh. Yes, hype for New Horizons. That's why I was like, you know what? I think I'll throw it back to some wild world. It's been a long time. Aw, Celeste is so cute. Oh dear. Oh, you're cute! Uh... Uh, stargazing. Yeah, you can like make constellations in this game. Which we have not done at all yet, so obviously... Let's see, can we... Can't we make like a... Yeah. Okay, let's see. Uh... Hmm. Wait, what the heck? That's not what I want. How come I can't make it like... I can't make it as big as I want? No. Oh no, it looks like- oh, it looks like a martini glass. No. Oh my god, no. How do I take this off? 
I don't know what I'm making right now. Oh my god. Uh... No. Uh... There we go. Uh... Here, I'll make a... A, a hot martini. I'll make it like fancy on the edge. Yeah. All right. Hot. Okay. Oh, sweet. Yes, please. We're going to call it Mar Teeny. Mm. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> it's really hot, you guys. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh my god, martini! Yeah, Pimptini. <laughs> 10 out of 10 name. Okay. We're done stargazing for the moment. Now, we've got to go downstairs because there's a lot more to the museum in this game than in New Leaf even because New Leaf, all this stuff was separated except for, not the constellation part, but this was separated. Alright, give me that coffee. Give me that cough. Um, this is where KK shows up in this game, much like in City Folk. Um, drink it before it gets cold. Did you guys see? I retweeted it on Twitter, but um, it's got a cool. Are you insane? Uh, the Animal Crossing movie, I wish it was airing everywhere, but it's airing in Japan on March 20th to celebrate the game coming out. Um, and I remember watching the movie with some friends years and years ago. Um, over Skype. Slim, I think you were there for that. I think you were one of the people who watched it with me. It was like me, you, Mega, Gaia maybe. There were like, uh, there were like five or six of us, I thought. There were quite a few of us watching it. Um, but it was really, really cute. I think PTM was there. Yeah, PTM was there. It may have just been the five of us, but it seems like somebody else was there too, maybe. It may, it may have been somebody who, like, kind of fell off the face of the planet, though. Like, in our chat or something like that. It seems like it was somebody like that who's not around anymore. But, um, but yeah, that was super cute. I really, it, it was really a cute movie. Some of their names were, like, wrong, though, or something. I don't know, it was weird. Or maybe it's just that they seemed wrong because they were, like, not the U.S. version. It was probably Exit Style or something, yeah. Um. Oh, Pudge, you're so emo. It was their Japanese names, but I remember being like, that's not their name? What? Like, uh, like Margie's in it, but it's her Japanese name. Which I cannot even remember the name, what her Japanese name is now. The Elephant... Yeah, watching that movie was the start of Exit Tyler's criminal record. Let it be known, you guys. Oh my god, why can't I catch this butterfly? Okay. Sally? I guess so. Why would I know that? I don't know. Too many amiibo cards. Um. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, why would I know about Yaki? Uh, you did, though. I asked you. I was like, you know who Yaki is? And you're like, isn't that key? Like, yeah. Um, Big Sal. No one's name is Bethany, but it, probably nobody's name will be Bethany because that's not like a... The TH sound isn't in the Japanese, like, vocabulary. So, like, they wouldn't ever add it, I wouldn't think. But... I think both of my, or all three of my sister's names are in Animal Crossing. 
One's really more of a nickname. Like, Natalie, there's Nat in Animal Crossing. Lisa is Reese in Japanese. Her name's Lisa. Um, and then my sister Layla, there's a bear who's a little cub, I think, like an island cub who's Layla, but it's spelled like, le like a lay, not like she spells it. So. What about Hanny, though? I mean, there is a chance for Hanny, you're right. <laughs> oh. I hope they re-release the amiibo cards when New Horizons comes out as well. Uh, I need to change this flag, so I'm gonna use one of these slots. Do I have to go... Oh, I don't know that I can do this yet, can I? I think I might not be able to do this yet, because I might have to unlock it at the Able Sisters, right? Or can I do it at Town Hall? Is it like, redesign the flag? I don't know. Oh shoot, I'm destroying my f more flowers. You had a Bettina? That's a different name though. <laughs> okay, talk to me. I honestly, I don't, wait. Uh, um, okay, um, honestly, I don't really uh, understand everything. <laughs> This is why Booker's my favorite, because he's so, like, dense about everything. Oh my gosh. Change the flag. Can I design it? Uh, yeah, I think I have to go to... What? I think I have to go to the Able Sisters for this. Um... Big Cop. Alright, I do not want to visit another town. Alright, so I like that they're little, like, security guards now. Where am I? No. Okay. Um, yeah, I think that... I think we're gonna have to... Unlock that Able Sisters feature before we can worry about the flag, which will be an insect on a stone wall, obviously. Um, Matina! I love Booker. I love him. Oh, I hear it. Where that bug? The heck, where's this bug? Yeah. Anyway. Um, we'll go and see if we can redesign one with Mabel. Oh, sweet. I can. I was like, wait, do I have to unlock this? Um, that's fine. Okay, I want it right here. Woo! Excuse me. And I want to... Uh, no, no. Uh, which palette do I want? No. Okay. Uh, so, let's see. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna have to do this. God, this is so hard to see. Can I, like, blow this up? Hmm. Uh. Fine, we'll just make it kind of ghetto fabulous. Because, you know what? Stones are not even all the time, you guys. I don't know what you're talking about. Um. Mm. Hot. Uh. Okay. 
So now we need to... What? Change the color of some of these to be more stony. Uh... There we go. Fabulous. Now we need... <laughs> Uh, we need a, like, an ant, I guess. Mm. Oh, shoot. No. Oh. I can't make my ant look good. No! There we go. Um. No. Oh my god. Oh, I can't. It's too small. Well, oh, uh, no, this is not what I wanted. Um, crap, I messed it up. No, that looks stupid. Fine, we'll just make a big old thing. Like that. We'll just make like a big beetle. Nope. There. There's a big beetle bug. Um, great. <laughs> that's our bug, that's our pill bug. On a stone wall. Okay, this touch screen's way too small for this. Formal, refined, basic, yet new. Hot. Okay. Let's see. Stone... Wall. Bugs. Cool. Alright. Alright guys, we have our flag now. And we're gonna put it right here in the shop. Tr Tim from Tree Hut, you're gonna have to suck it. So, I want to display. I don't mind. That's Fine. Get rid of freaking Tim from Treehouse or whatever. With my big stone wall bugs. Alright! So hot! <laughs> big bug. Yeah, Van Gogh wishes he had the talent Big Beffy has. Bug on a stone wall hype. Okay, you guys ready for this? We're gonna go display our flag now. And you know what? It's gonna be hot. Bug on a stone wall. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, Madam Warrior presents Ant. The ant failed. It turned into a pill bug. A little beetle bug because the touch screen was too small for our ant. Um. Alright. Use this. I don't care. Um. Oh wait, we should swap it because we should swap it with this dumb umbrella pattern. Okay, now we'll switch it again so that way we'll have the little Tortimer pattern because it's cute. Uh, change flag. Use this. So what? Yeah, because the Tortimer, Tortimer's pride is pretty cute. All right, cool. Let's go check it out, you guys. <laughs> you know I hate this flag, yeah. Oh, check out that stone wall bug hype. So hot. When I think moonbeam, I think a bug on a stone wall, obviously. 
Um, do I have anything else in my pocket? Oh, I, I have all this crap in my pocket. I need to... Well, I need to give these three to the museum, and then I can sell these two things. Uh, da -da, da -da. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sell these last couple things and then call it a stream. Oh, actually, I'm gonna collect seashells before I do that. So that way I have big hype. Can't wait for the new bug type Pokemon stone wall, yeah. We didn't shake the trees today, but I figure... Well, I guess we could shake this little area here. Get rid of this... Put my net away. Put my net in its letter. Oh, yes. Let's just see if any furniture falls out in this little area right here. If not, we won't worry about it. Um, I really should just leave that money on the ground so I know that I shook whichever tree it's coming from. But yeah, this is my new wild world town, this is Moonbeam. I'm giving a throwback to my original Animal Crossing town on GameCube called Hogwarts, where um, Beffy originated. So that was my original character name. I just recently had a poll on Twitter for what my new Horizons character should be named, and I'm so excited because Bobo won, and I've never had Bobo as a character name before. That's my nickname in real life, but um, yeah, I've never used that name on a character, so I'm very excited for that. New Horizons, so we gotta get a new name. I was kind of pulling for that name, and I, I Madam was winning for a long time, and I was like, well, you know, that's fine too. That's also who I am, and that's who, you know, my character has always been. But I was really excited when, when Bobo came through in the end. I didn't mean to talk to you, but I guess we are now, Blue Bear. What?! Oh my god, could you just cool it with this dumb pill bug crap? I'm so annoyed by the pill bug lore. Like, no. <laughs> oh my god, these dang pill bugs. I cannot deal with this. I'm telling you guys, I'm, I'm screenshotting this too because there's too much pill bug. Too much pill bug. So many pill bugs, so little game. Oh my god. It wasn't that cute. It was kind of heinous. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, this dumb pill bug. Oh. Anyway, so I'm still going back and forth with the name. It might be something cute like Moonbeam. Or it might be something big. I don't know for sure yet. I'm just gonna have to go with my gut when the time comes. Probably won't have a vote for that. I'll probably just decide on my own because I don't have a solid enough idea right now to have a vote. Um, and again, I'm kind of just gonna get a feel for the game when I first turn it on and see what strikes my fancy, you know. Um, but I'm so excited for New Horizons. Again, I'm working on a lot of merch for my shop. A lot of the merchandise um, is going up shortly because I'm taking photographs today. So some of it might be up today. Um, you know, I'm not gonna promise anything just because I might be doing a bit of editing with those, but uh, either way, it'll be up shortly. It'll be up before the release of the game. Some probably with the release of the game. But yeah, I'm big excited. Big, big excited for that. Freaking pitfalls. Um, other than that, um, other little announcements. My Patreon has gotten an update. If you're interested in checking that out, please do so. It's patreon.com slash Wario. The link is below the stream. Um, and I have my Patreon exclusive podcast on there right now which you can access for pledging as little as $1 a month this month, and then it, it turns into the $10 tier after that. But, um, oh. Anyway, so 
uh, that's going on. So if you want to know all my thoughts behind New Horizon, that's in that podcast that's a Patreon exclusive. It's kind of something I've started on Patreon. Um, and other than that, my next stream is planned for Friday. Friday at 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Now we're in Daylight Savings and it's kind of, you know, messed with my mind. It always does. So, um, yeah, that's going to be on Friday at 8 and it is the first Mario Party 2 stream of Series 2. So we're finally, whoops, we're finally to Series, or er, we're finally to the second game in the series. So, uh, Kirby 64 is still going on. I'm uploading it every other day. Today was an off day, so you'll see more of that tomorrow. And I think that's, that's everything. So... I think that is everything that I have announcements for. So I'm gonna just leave it here. I'll go save on my own. Um, but yes, Mario Party 2 hype. I wanna give uh, credit where credit is due on Patreon. Thank you guys so much for uh, your epic generosity and for pledging every single month to help me continue content creation online. It's greatly appreciated. So shout out to my Patreon family. And yeah, so that's going to do it today, you guys. Oh, thank you for being here. Thank you for being at the stream. To everybody, thank you to Go4 for, for all the gift subs and the sub hype train earlier. That was super fun. Um, got some new emotes from that, so that's super exciting. Kalurin, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Pimp Zone. And I will see all of you guys on Friday. So love you all. Get hyped. <laughs> Bye, guys.